Wow. That's game over. Legend of Zelda cover with a lot of new elements that I really liked. And that's, um, that is Red Vox friend, Intermotion Music, Gerald. So I'm going to link that in chat. Obviously, I'm biased, as I've said plenty of times, but every time I hear one of these things for the first time, which is now, usually when I start a stream, I'm like, holy goddamn. Holy goddamn. So, yeah, that that's going to be a link in chat for sure. And also a link in game, because when you play the game, Link is the character. Do you know why he was called Link? Because that's right, Miyamoto drove a Lincoln. So welcome. Welcome to the stream, everybody. <clears throat> Vinny, did you go see King Gizzard this weekend? Yes. I did. I was there yesterday. And uh, it was cool. I, they were They were really good. I no longer know even half of their set when I go to one of their shows. <laughs> but um, they did some stuff I really was happy to hear. And they were jamming and having fun. And it was heavy as fuck. Did you see Ambrose Moon? I didn't. I looked away at chat for a second. No, I weirdly missed it. And a friend of mine was like, Vinny, did you see... Did you see he mooned? I'm like, yeah, that's fine. I don't need to see that. Uh, but they were really good. And there were a number of people that um, said hi to me. And I had Red Vox stickers because, you know, I, again, I, pre I prefer not to tell people when I'm going to concerts. But, I mean, if someone says hi, I'll give them a sticker. Or if I have one. And uh, someone was wearing a Red Vox shirt. And they were seated not very far from me. So it was really cool. But yeah, they were... Ambi riding the gator with a cowboy hat was iconic. It was great. Yeah, I mean, and they were awesome. I mean, the sound was good. I love that stadium. It, it rained for a bit, but then it, it held and the show was awesome. So it was kind of a reverse of the Foo Fighters show where, um, you know, it was clear for the a concert. But yeah, I, I really love seeing King Gizzard. They're just a lot of fun to watch and they have so much different, like type of material I don't really know how to say it they just have so many genres um, vomit coffin was very nice yes that's the name of one of their songs uh, slow jam was good have you given their new album a second chance yeah I've given it two chances three chances and uh, I enjoyed about half of it a lot and some of it I was like kind of miss so far still but seeing them live was awesome and I I'm glad if anyone was there, it was nice to meet you. And it was really fucking cool that people were like, Hey, Vinny, I like what you do. And I and someone was like, Vinny, you got me into King Gizzard and now I'm here. So that was awesome. Um, someone said, Vinny, can you tell your boss at Twitch to fix the mobile app? I don't know how to answer that because um, these I don't know who even is my boss at Twitch. <laughs> I don't, I don't think I have a boss. I think it's just company. And they just kind of do their own thing and fuck up their own product. Sorry. I don't know how bad it is. I haven't used the mobile app, so I don't know. But hey, uh, welcome to the stream, everybody. Thanks for joining today. It's another Sunday. And uh, it's been an interesting week this past week of gaming. And next week will be interesting, too. I'm going to be playing more Unmetal. And Nintendo World Championship game, NES edition, I think. So, and some more multiplayer stuff. But today, we have Raw Dog Simulator. Listen. I, uh, I know you're worried about getting weird with it, getting shaft baited. But please understand, it's the best segment to end a stream with. Because I have... A ton of games in a folder, and I can just play as many as I want before I get tired. I don't believe Raw Dog Simulator is going to take very long. So, it's kind of more like three segments tonight. But we'll, we'll see in a minute. We'll see in a minute. Vinny, are there any other Aussie music artists you like, or just Gizzard? Uh, big fan of Pond. 
Tame Impala was kind of a huge band for me before um, Slow Rush, which is a fine album. But, you know, I, that's not... I like... I do like their earlier stuff better, and Currents was really good, too. But I still like them, and I'll listen to, you know, their next album for sure. But I like I like the rock sound, which is why I like Gizzard so much. Uh, but I love Pond. Gum is really good. Um, a, does ACDC count? I mean... Vinny, where can I buy a shirt? Can't find official ones, just red, red bubble shit. Oh god. Um, alright. Let me see. So you want to try Juniper? Vine Sauce Juniper. Maybe Google that. I'll try to get you a link. Hang on. Here, I'm, you know what? Just go to Linktree Vinny Vine Sauce. I'm going to link it in chat. You, and scroll down and you'll see a bunch of merch. So there's a bunch of different things you can check out. All right. Now, before we begin, speaking of merch. Chat, these weird browser games keep happening. And uh, this is called Cost Codal. And you have to guess the price of the product. This is real. Hmm, organic Brussels sprouts. I'm going to say $6.99. It's higher. $8.99. Lower. $7.99. Higher. This is a fun game. I'm having so much fun. $8.50. Wow. That's amazing. Just so much fun. Let me see if I can play any past ones. Uh, no, I don't think I can. So all you get is just one. So, all right, 850 for Brussels sprouts. But hang on a minute, chat. There's another one call called Gamedal. And you can guess a game by its cover, which seems kind of easy. This is just going to keep happening. Wordle changed the world, didn't it? Wait, North's just got moved. Okay, um, let's see, what game cover is this? I don't know what this is. Sable? Wow. Uh, what's this one, chat? One time clue. I'm, I'm pretty bad at this, hang on. So, so you can just keep skipping and you get more pieces of the cover. Prince of Persia. This is, um, is this... Wow, who thought I would be so bad at guessing covers? I can guess the music, but... It, oh, God of War. I don't know which God of War. New? Oh, hang on. God of War. Ghost of Sparta. <laughs> um... Burnout? No. Splort. For Forza. Alright. Um. Is this this looks like a um Space Marine Warhammer? This is Borderlands. How about that movie? It's not Tiny Tina. Wait, this isn't Borderlands. Why did I think this was Borderlands? Oh god, Dreamfall. Oh, <laughs> this one... Anno. Anno. What the fuck is this? Yu-Gi-Oh. 
Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. Hmm. My, my Hero Ultra Rumble. I was close. I, th <laughs> I think I might know this one. I might have played this one. V, 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 V. Let's do a couple more. It is, it is blue. Crackdown. Parappa. Oh, 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 uh... Viva Pin Pinata? Yes! Never even played that game. This one looks familiar. Untold Stories. It wasn't familiar at all, in fact. Untitled Goose Game? Oh, yeah. And this one's Yu-Gi-Oh. No. Fantasy Star Online. Sonic. Oh, I wonder how many Sonic games I'll have to scroll through to find out which one this is. I'm gonna guess original. There we go. Uh, this one's familiar-ish. Marvel. This, wait, Resident Evil? No. Uh, Walking, Walking Dead. Season one. Walking Dead season two. All right. One more. Nope, don't know this one. Never heard of this game ever in my life. Now, there's also... Guess the game by its artwork. I'm gonna say... Battlefield 1. No. Ace Combat? Huh. Wrong franchise and saga. Project Wingman, Chad is saying. All right. Okay, so yeah, there's just a lot of these types of games now. And this is this is what life is. You can just find an infinite number. So I'll tell you what, chat. We're going to raw dog.